I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. New numbers from USDA moved commodity markets in different directions on Tuesday with corn sinking and soybeans rising. Traders reacting to the current supply demand numbers with corn down 50 million bushels, but not as low as market watchers expected. Soybeans, though, were closer to what was expected. Exports for both are expected to increase. Wheat was basically unchanged. But just how much U.S. ag product is going overseas? Well, John Newton of the American Farm Bureau Federation creating this graphic. It shows for calendar year 2020, U.S. ag exports totaled $161 billion. Now that's up 4% year to date. And you can see who was the biggest customer, China, with sales to that country up 75% from 2019. Maybe you don't think the life of a Holstein is that exciting, eating, grazing, spending time in the milking parlor, but a whole herd of them recently went on an adventure in northern Indiana. The LaPorte County Sheriff's Office saying the herd of Holstein calves just left their home. A short time later, an off-duty deputy spotted the high-energy group running southbound in the northbound lanes of a busy road, and the chase was on. Eventually, deputies, the owners, volunteers, firefighters, and several good Samaritans were able to gather them all up. They are now back at home. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on the station or anytime at agweb.com and follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.